on the plane that uh, was carrying Prigozhin that went down in Russia, um, was it a bomb that took the plane down? Um, so, so a couple things. Um, I know there's a lot of interest in this topic. I'll, I'll say right up front, um, first of all, our initial assessment is that it's likely uh, Prigozhin was killed. Um, we're continuing to assess uh, the situation. Um, we don't have any information to indicate right now. Um, the press reporting uh, stating that there was some type of surface-to-air missile that took down the plane. That we assess that information to be inaccurate. Uh, again, nothing to indicate, no information to suggest that there was a surface-to-air missile. Um, but beyond that, I'm, I'm really just not going to have any further information. What was it, something that came internal from inside the plane? Again, I, I don't have any uh, additional insight to provide on that. Thank you. Oren. I just want to check the first thing you said. Our initial assessment is that it's likely Prigozhin was killed. You mean killed intentionally, a la this may well have been an assassination attempt. Killed in this uh, airplane oh, he crash. He was on board. And what leads you to believe that? What information do you have to suggest that he was on board? Or is this based based on the fact that you have no reason to doubt Russian reports? Yeah, I'm not going to go into the specifics uh, of how we gather information other than, again, our initial s assessment uh, based on a variety of factors is that he was likely killed. But not just based on, on Russian statements, I would imagine. Uh, based on a variety of, of factors.